Hey, New Hope, Pastor Austin here. I'm so thankful that you're tuning in today. We are one week out from a very important election, and if you have not done so already, please vote. You have the right and the ability to vote, and so uh, we need godly men and women in places of office so that godly principles and godly laws would be placed, and, and uh, we just really need a, a godly leading in this nation. And uh, if you were not at church on Sunday, then you would have missed Pastor Weaver's call to fasting and prayer. And I know some of you have already planned to do that with Franklin Graham. But we as a church have decided long ago that we are going to fast the week of the election. And so I would ask you, what are you going to fast this week? Is it going to be lunch? Is it going to be a complete fast? Is it going to be um, a, a solids fast where you're only drinking you know, smoothies or, or whatever it might be? What are you going to fast and then what are you going to replace? And, and fasting means nothing if we're not replacing that time with spending time in prayer and worship and really seeking the face of God. This nation is not going to be saved by a political party. This nation is not going to be saved by a political candidate. This nation needs a saving from Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, the hope of the world where we can have a confidence that whatever comes our way, we will be okay and we can say it is well in our soul because Jesus is King and he's Lord. Remember that we are citizens of the kingdom of God first and then we are citizens of America second. And so my hope and my eyes are on Jesus this presidential election and I just wanna challenge you again, fast something and replace that time with prayer. And I know for me this week, I'm gonna do my best to stay off of social media and uh, you might get a, a Facebook message from me. I use Messenger a lot to reach out to some of you and encourage you. But as far as just scrolling through Facebook or Instagram, I'm gonna be off those this week. And so um, that's what I'm gonna be fasting and I'll be having my kids and my family. We're gonna fast one meal this week and we'll spend time in prayer. And uh, I just wanna encourage you to all do so. So let me pray for you, God. We acknowledge you as Lord and Savior and King upon the throne. And I pray that in this upcoming election, that godly men and women would be placed into a seat of authority and that you would have your hand in all of this. Guide us that we would vote not on personality, but on principles, and that we would vote um, and use the freedom that we have that we might honor you in our votes and it would reflect you. And so Jesus, have your way in our hearts in the time of fasting in every household. Would you reveal more of yourself to us and would there be a blessing that follows in jesus name we pray amen god bless you guys and we'll see you on sunday